first, fast, accurate. You're watching WSBT 22 News at 530. It's an epidemic that's sweeping through Michigan, impacting families of every background. Now, it's addiction to prescription drugs and heroin. And new at 530, communities across Berrien County are learning how to tackle the issue and help loved ones. WSBT 22's Heather Black has the story. More than 300 people in Berrien County gathered at St. Joseph High School to find the answers to stop the use of prescription drugs and heroin. They heard personal testimonies like former heroin addict Justin Gajewski, who remembers how one Vicodin pill launched his obsession. I didn't wake up saying I wanted to be an addict as my career. Like, that's not what I said, you know, and, or thought. It was more that it was accessible. For other former addicts like Preston Ross, it was peer pressure at 15 that started his difficult journey. I had friends that were doing it. I had people that I'd grown up with using heroin, so it was, it was kind of... Uh, Easy for me. Michigan's Department of Community Health reports drug-related deaths are up 18% this year. However, people at the forum say the county is making a difference. With prescription drugs and heroin use on the rise, some Berrien County public officials are offering more treatment options for addicts and less jail time. Our criminal justice system is responding. Uh, we're using treatment uh, programs to try to get at the, the real core of the problem. Once addicts are in the program, they say it's the support that helps them overcome. They accepted me for who I was, and, and that's what really kept me and brought me back here. We are people, too, and we do want to live amongst people. We just don't know how, and we need to be taught how. In St. Joseph, Michigan, Heather Black, WSBT 22 News. So far, 12 people have graduated from Berrien County's treatment program.